22 true freshmen played for Illinois in 2017, but Kendrick Green wasn't one of them. Four years later, no one in the class is better positioned than Green to hear his name called in the NFL draft. It's been a dream my whole life, man. I'm ready to do it. Ready to, uh, you know, ready to go play ball. Green is projected to be just the third Illinois player drafted since 2016, last in the Big Ten in that time. The guard has been challenged in his time with the Illini, including transitioning from defense to offense in his redshirt season. Now he's ranked as the sixth best interior offensive lineman in the draft, according to Pro Football Focus. I want to show, show the NFL, you know, I'm a dependable guy, a uh, durable guy, you know, I want to be a guy, uh, teams draft me, I want to be able to just, you know, slide myself in. Green isn't the only former Alana hoping to be picked. Milo Eifler, Nate Hobbs, and Josh Imatorbebe all worked out at the Illinois Pro Day in March and have been training since turning pro. It's not like college where you kind of are in control, right? Um, when you're getting, I guess, recruited or scouted by, you know, these teams. Just the fact that I don't have as much control as I've had in the past, it's a little nerve-wracking, but if anything, it makes me double down and focus on the things that I can control. Emat Torbebe has a chance to be picked. Some mock drafts have him going in the late rounds, but Green is being projected as high as a third-round choice. Yet, when he looks back, Green says he wouldn't have believed he would make it this far. But, you know, I've been working for this my whole life, so, you know, I feel like now it's time to take the shot, so I'm excited. But absolutely, I would tell you, you're crazy. Dwayne Smoot was the highest Illinois pick in the last seven years, going in the third round of 2017. Reporting for Urolina Nation, Andy Olson, WCIA 3 Sports.